Well, hi guys, good morning and uh, welcome again. This is going to be a short video on how to send and receive text messages or files using the Yesu Fusion radios. And we're going to demonstrate how to do it on the FTM 400. It's really, really easy and uh, it's a lot of fun. You can send pictures, you can send large files or text messages. You can do it in digital C4FM or you can do it if you're in the APRS mode. But uh, let me go ahead and identify. This is again. Very good. Okay. So in order to do this, to send and receive messages, you have to have a micro SD card inserted in the radio. So in this case, we have one in the FTM 400 and we also have one in this other radio, which is the FT1. This is uh, what I'm going to receive the message radio from the FTM 400. So this radio has a micro SD card and it's inserted here. Uh, so if you don't have the micro SD card, you will not be able to send messages. So again, that's very vital to do the message thing. You have to have a micro SD card inserted in both radios. So basically to send a message or receive a message or read a message, you have to go to your log. And to get to the log, you simply press the F button on the right here. You press the F button. Okay, and then that gives you that uh, half screen with a lot of information on it. If you don't see the log right away, you press these uh, arrows on the right and left to get to the log if you don't see it right away. So I'm going to go ahead and press on the log. Okay, so this gives you me uh, a file folder of all the messages. Who did I get a message from? And in this case, it's me. I'm testing here. And I'm sending messages to all. And it gives you options down on the bottom. Um, you know, to delete the message, to go back. Okay, or to scroll all the way down. It gives you the date and all the information. Okay, and then you can, of course, you can compose a new message right here on the top so to read the message you just select one and you press on the dial on the upper dial or you can press on the screen but I'm gonna go ahead press on the upper dial and this is the message of course it's all gibberish gives you the date the time where the message came from you can reply, forward, delete, okay, so you have some choices. So let me go ahead and delete this one. Okay, delete, yep, okay, so we press okay, so that message is deleted. Okay, so let's go to the part where you compose a new message. So basically you scroll to the top with the upper dial right here on the right top right or you can do it by hand it's a touch screen after all you press enter and then you can compose a message now you can use the microphone keys but what I really like about this radio is you can use a keyboard right down here you have a keyboard so if you bring it up and this is your keyboard really cool you guys it's so easy you won't put the words you can go caps you can backspace forward space um, you can go to a number screen right here okay and then all you gotta do is touch the letters so I'm gonna send a, a test message right now so everything you input I'm gonna put space here we go and if I want to put some numbers I go here 
and I input some numbers. Okay, I can also input um, other characters as you can see here. All right, so once you're done with your text, you press enter on the bottom right here. So this is the message that we're going to send. Okay, so now all you're going to do is hit send and the message will go out. And you'll hear the other radio beep, meaning it received the message. Okay, so now I'm holding this radio here. This is the radio that we're going to send the message to because it's listening on the same frequency. Okay, so you're going to hear that radio beep when I send the message. There we go. Completed. So, that is awesome, you guys. That's really cool. That is really cool. So, you can send messages. You can receive messages. Even big files, like picture files, documents, whatever you want to send. So, anyway, um, I hope I covered everything here. Again, you need a, a micro SD card in the radio to be able to do this. And, uh, of course... Um, you need uh, you could do it on a simplex frequency you could do it on a repeater frequency if you're listening to a repeater you can send messages through the repeater to a receiving station on the other end uh, you can also do it through wires if you have a wires X node you could do that as well in a digital mode um, so to exit out of the screen you simply push the back button here on the bottom left and then press F again and that puts you back in the normal screen right here okay guys thank you for listening and 73's from N1CY